Hey guys! Hi guys! Welcome back to the channel. This is Olivia and Mummy reporting about today's news. She's got her Paw Patrol controller. She's got her sky hat on and she's ready to rock and roll. So we'll see you soon. Bye guys. Bye guys! Welcome back to my channel and if you're new here, welcome to the Makeup Mummy family. And guys, if you are new to my channel, I'd appreciate it greatly if you can hit that subscribe button and join me here at Makeup Mummy. And remember and hit that bell also as it'll notify you every time I upload, which is Wednesdays, Fridays and Sundays. So guys, we're doing an unboxing. We're doing December's Love Me Beauty unboxing and I can't wait to show you guys what I did pick up. So if you want to see what I did get, then just keep on watching. Hey, my lovelies so this is the little bag we got this time i absolutely love this makeup bag actually i really do like it i've got a stray piece of string there so on the front is a, a lady sipping some champagne and it says i didn't choose the glam life the glam life chose me so i really do like that cool i love the blue and white i my favorite color is blue as you could tell by the background and um, I absolutely love this bag so let's get into what we picked this time so again it's the same scenario guys if you did miss my last unboxing I'm going to try and link it in the description box um, for you guys um, but basically what it is is every month you get 60 credits and you pay a fee now the membership varies so mine's is eight pounds plus the 3.95 pmp so it takes it to just over 11 pounds you can of course pay more for your membership so i would imagine if you pay more for your membership you're going to get more credits throughout the month now generally on the first of the month they take your monthly payment and then the second of the month they then Reloop the edit so you get some new products to pick from. I like this subscription simply because you are getting to pick and choose what you want. You're not restricted to just they send you a box and that's what you get. I like that you can just select what you really want to try. I also like the fact that most of these are sample sizes, so you're getting to just sample a little bit of a product, see if you like it first, and then of course if you do like it, you just go and purchase the full size. You're not then splurging a whole lot of money on a product that maybe doesn't do anything for you or you're just not enjoying it just gives you a little trial size of course on the website there are um fuller size products but you're paying more credits for them um so it's just down to your own personal preference i think it's a great little subscription box i love the fact you get a different makeup bag every month i love the fact that you pick and choose your products and you're getting a good 60 credits and most of the stuff on here is between 5 10 15 and 20 credits so again it just depends what you want to try this time i got four products whereas last time i got five but again it's just these were the products i really wanted to give a go so let's just delve on in and pick our first little product here so this is from nukes nux here we go again with the names guys just please forgive me i'm not very good at pronunciation so we're just going to roll with this i will show you what it is of course so this is a micellar cleansing water so you're getting 35 mils in this and it is 1.1 fluid ounces again it is just for face and eyes so you're just going to take a cotton pad put in a few drops of this on your cotton pad and just removing your makeup and there's no need to rinse it um so this is what the packaging looks like, quite nice and petite. And I'm just going to bring it closer so you guys can see the name of the brand um, because Michelle's sloppy pronunciation is just out of this world. Um, I like that it's very simple looking. It is a screw top, of course, as well. Beautiful, ugh, beautiful, beautiful scent. Really, really powdery and just very subtle, nothing too major. So again, you're not going to be overpowered by the smell. I'm not, of course, going to tip it out because it is micellar water. So it's very, very runny and watery. So that was my first little product. I'm very eager to try this because I do love skincare and I do love micellar waters. So I'm really excited to give this a go. I think I'm going to swap my Primark for this one and just try this out until it's finished. See what I think. Next product, guys, let me just delve on in here. It's from the same brand, Nooks or Nux. I'm really going to have to get a grip of this pronunciation. I really am. This is a hand and nail cream. So you're getting 15 mils, which is 0 0.50 ounces. Um, and again, it's just obviously a hand cream and it repairs, nourishes and protects. So again, great in this weather, isn't it? I mean, in 
the winter time. I mean, my hands, I don't know about you guys, but my hands really dry out. Like I said, I do have some eczema, so they dry out and if it gets really cold, they can end up cracking and chapping, which is very, very uncomfortable. So I am a lover of hand creams. I mean, currently I'm using one from Avon, which is the African Shea Butter um, Hand Cream, which is an excellent hand cream, good, by the way, guys. But I'm going to give this one a go and see what this one does. Um, like I said, just a sample size. And I think this one was like five credits. So very, very inexpensive. Um, I really, really like the packaging of this. It's just very clean, very elegant, just really nice packaging. So yeah, that is the second product. So we'll give that a go and see how that takes us throughout the winter months. The next product we have here is an oil and it's from Cordelia and it is the Divine Oil Body Face in here. You're getting 50 mils of this, which is 0, 0.5 fluid, fluid ounces. And it just looks like this. So as you can see, I'm just going to see if this is a pulley off or it's a, it's a screw top, this one. So again, same thing as the micellar water. Just be very careful because it's going to be very, very runny. I'm just going to put, I am going to attempt to put just a couple of drops on my hand there. So as you can see, goes into the skin very, very nice and feels amazing on the skin, guys. Amazing. It's just a very florally smell. Roses. Really, really pretty though. But again, if you're not into the whole scent scene, I would definitely stay away because this product is quite florally. It does settle down in the skin though, so I don't think it's going to remain that florally as it's sitting in, but it goes into the skin really nice. It's not looking greasy or oily, just really, really nice. And it just feels really nourishing on the skin. You can, of course, use this on your hair as well. So I would just use this. As, do not go near the roots, guys, because putting it too close to the roots can make your hair just look really greasy, weigh it down. So I would just, if you're going to use a product like this for your hair, just put a little drop on your hand, just rub that in and just take from mid lengths to ends and just pull it through the hair. And it's just going to help nourish the hair. It's going to add shine to the hair. Um, so yeah, I am really looking forward to using this product. I think I definitely will use it for my body as well though, especially coming out after the shower when I'm feeling a little drier, put some of this oil on and see if that helps out. Now, I have one more product for you guys um, to share with you, and I am quite excited to try it. Um, it is a makeup brush duo, and it's from Eco Tools. So as you can see, these are full-size brushes, um, and it's the Enhancing Eye Set um, for brush heads. It's 100% vegan, it's cruelty-free, and it's renewable bamboo and recyclable packaging as well so excellent excellent product and um, I've heard lots of good things about the eco tools brushes um, and like I said I'm just going to take these out so we can see what it has to offer that's if Michelle can get it out of the packaging because we could be here for quite some time okay lovelies they are out of the box and I love there's a little quote inside the box here it has a love heart and it says your inner beauty never needs makeup now i absolutely adore that because you know what ladies gents you don't need makeup to feel beautiful and i know we all have those days where we look in the mirror and we think dear lord really but you know what we're all beautiful in our own way and i think the sooner people realize that the better it's going to be <sighs> makeup just enhances what is already there we're already beautiful in our own right we may not have the perfect figure we may not have the perfect skin perfect hair perfect lips perfect whatever but we're humans we're not meant to be perfect and you know i'm happy for the longest time after my little girl god we're getting quite deep but hey um for the longest time after my little girl i just looked in the mirror and i was never happy with what i saw i just felt i was really really um for better lack of a word, ugly. I just didn't like what I see, didn't like my skin, didn't like my hair, didn't like my body shape. Nothing was making me happy. And it wasn't until one day, you know, just looking at my little girl, went through some counselling for other issues and I just thought to myself, you know what? I am happy with my body. I have lost a little bit of weight since then, but I'm happy with how it looks. It's not perfect. It's not slim, but I'm happy. I'm happy with what I look in the mirror. When I, when I look in the mirror, I'm happy with what I see. 
And I think that's what it is, finding your inner peace, finding your inner happiness and just saying, you know, this is me, I'm here, I'm happy, I'm beautiful. Yeah, that's it, that's it. I just, I just don't know how to put it in words, guys. I just think you all need to, we all need to take a look at ourselves and realise we are all beautiful in our own right. All beautiful. And I want my little girl to grow up and realise that she's beautiful no matter what she looks like and no matter what her body looks like, she's beautiful. So now we've gotten past the whole deep, 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 talk there let's move back to our brushes sorry about that guys I was kind of like off track there um but yes these are from eco tools so we've got a shade and define and we've got a smudge and blend so it tells you on the front here this is your eco tools and then it tells you on the back here what each brush is for um they are super soft absolutely beautiful feeling brushes i'm going to love this for getting just right into that crease and um, the smudger is going to be excellent for putting like shimmers on and for getting right in that corner i'll use the definer for obviously just my brow area and then this one here which is shade i'm going to use this for just outer corner so I'm going to put these to good use. I love the feel of them and I love that they're vegan and cruelty free. And I love, love the coat in that box. So well done to Eco Tools. I'm going to report back to you guys and what I think. Now, just before I finish this video, guys, I have just about finished the Bare Minerals Skin Longevity from my last unboxing. I love this stuff and I'm going to be sad that it's finished. I was looking at how much a full size bottle is and it's about 42, 43 pounds, which is very, very expensive, but I feel it works. So I may have to invest in that down the road. The body lotion for me is just a body lotion. It just does what every other body lotion is. So I don't know if I would splurge out on it. I actually haven't checked um, the price of that online, but I will do. Um, what else did we try? The Kat Von D is finished. I absolutely love that perfume, but I kind of knew I was going to. Um, yeah, pretty much everything that I did try in the last unboxing, I have liked. Um, obviously, the body lotion, I don't think I'll go out and buy the Kat Von D again down the road I will be repurchasing that as well as the Skin Longevity from Bare Minerals so again the same with this in January's unboxing at the end of the video I will obviously tell you guys what I feel about the products right here but until that time guys if you've liked the video you like what you saw here today give this video a thumbs up and if you haven't subscribed to my channel guys it would be completely amazing if you could um, and just hit that bell if you do subscribe to my channel just to notify you every time I upload which again is Wednesdays Friday Fridays and Sundays. So until the next video, guys, you take care and we shall see you soon. Bye.